What's up? How you guys doing? My name is Tony Gomez. I'm one of the art mentors or art pastor and uh, handle the outside, the graffiti part. And then, uh, we bring out art supplies. Uh, we get a bunch of canvases where people are able to either donate money so we can buy canvases for each session. Or what we do, a lot of the local artists, a lot of the young people, the college age, some of the older adults, they paint. And then what they do is they donate their artwork here. And so what we do is we display them online or even here on site or we send them to churches and um, they display them and people can buy them and then they just donate the money and all the money will go back to buying more canvases here at the session. Um, why, why we do Saint City Session, probably you guys are asking some questions at nighttime. Right here in Santa Ana, a lot of crazy stuff goes on, but I heard a teacher recently say that that there's so much untapped potential here in the city of Santa Ana that, that, that there's, why he teaches at, at Santa Ana High School is because the talent that just is just waiting to be unearthed there, and, and that's really the heart of Saint City Session. That there's graffiti art, there, there's break dancing, there's music, and you know, and people kind of look at those things and it's like, man, you know what? It's just like a different element. Maybe it has this bad reputation, but but you gotta understand the heart of creativity. That God's the one that created you and I. He's given us the skills, the talents to to write. Um, you know to sing you know and most most importantly again to, to create and for me I have a passion and love for art uh, whether it's graffiti art or whether it's with a brush and so what we do is we always start the night off with the kids the young adults we pray and I just ask the Lord to be in this place to bless them and that the art and whatever they do the creativity I remind them that that's a gift that God's given them and so it's just a way for us to to allow them to recognize that the gifts that they have comes from the Lord and it, what it is it's just a it's an avenue for them to, to be able to get out of the streets and to be able to do it in a safe place at the church so when you look at it in that sense that the church is a place a safe haven for them to be able to practice the skills that maybe the street skills that they have but then also too to show them that they can do it here underneath the Lord's house and um, some people are doing some awesome things we have one of the brothers that just donated this right here it's a uh, it says Saint City Session, and uh, it, what it is, it's a black book, and it just donated work like this, and you know, and this is gonna attract some young people, and they'll do their artwork in there. Some of it might be Christian, some of it may not, but they're gonna be asking the question of what Saint City, and what it is, it's an urban hip hop um, outreach a session where they can come and be able to be exposed by people like like yourself or myself that are here and they have a heart. They're just gonna come and just donate their time. And we just walk around and say, hey man, that's a good job. They're like, what? Yeah, yeah, that's that's tight. And you could just be in, you could begin to tell them that, yeah, God's given you that gift and that creativity. And you know what? The art, the creativity is from the Lord. And that's really the most important thing that young people need to understand, that they do have gifts, but in the hands of God, man, they, be, they can become tools to be outreach, to become tools to be able to, to do great things in the future and use these gifts. And uh, so that's it. I, I just want to leave you guys with that. Peace. God bless you guys. And we appreciate just your prayers and everything that you guys um, donate as far as time and maybe resources to continue to make this happen. So God bless you. Peace out.